March Madness is one of the most exciting times of the year for people who in the, who love college basketball. And when you could couple that with uh, some good philanthropic things, I think that uh, Senator Broden and I are excited about the fact that we get to fill out our brackets and sort of compete with each other. But we want to encourage people to uh, participate in the March for Hunger and uh, make sure that they donate either food or food items money to uh, Gleaner's Food Bank to make sure we feed the hungry. And uh, I could just say for my brackets, uh, Senator Broden, I, I've, I've got Kentucky winning the whole thing. I think that this year's uh, NCAA tournament is Kentucky versus the rest of the field. I don't think that there's any team that uh, is out there that could beat these guys unless they beat themselves. So, uh, you know, uh, other than that, I've got a couple first-round uh Couple first round upsets. I've got Buffalo beating West Virginia. Uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm not a Duke fan, but uh, Bobby Hurley, uh, I think, has got those guys excited, and I think that they're going to do well. Uh, got a, you know, North Carolina, Kentucky, Virginia, and Iowa State as my final four. Uh, I think it's a toss up between Iowa and Duke, uh, but I guess you're going to go with with Duke. I don't know why you're an Indiana guy, but. <laughs> Actually, I, I well, uh, first Senator Taylor, I I, I would uh, first like to totally agree with you. Your comments on the march against uh, hunger, uh, March Madness, obviously uh, is a Senator Taylor said a very exciting time of year. Uh, uh, but first and foremost, we certainly want to focus on the march against hunger and hope uh, uh, people do participate. Uh, I actually have the Wisconsin Badgers winning it all, Senator Taylor. I do have Duke in the final. Excuse me, I have. Virginia in the final game. I do have Duke in my final four. Uh, I don't have Kentucky. Uh, oh, okay. I think I don't want to say Kentucky's overrated because you go through the season undefeated, but I did see several of their games uh, during January and February when they broke into those games where they were in close battles with uh, Ole Miss and LSU. And I think the SEC from top to bottom is uh, certainly the weakest of the Power Five conference, uh, uh, conferences. So I, I don't think Kentucky's been tested the way teams like Wisconsin, Virginia, and Duke have been tested. I didn't have a great deal of first round upsets. I think your pick of uh, uh, Buffalo is a very good one, though, and I thought long and hard about that. I did have uh, Eastern Washington beating Georgetown. Uh, you know, saw Eastern Washington beat uh, Indiana in Assembly Hall uh, earlier this year. I was very impressed with that team, uh, and they went on to have a great season. That, that ended up not being a bad loss at all for Indiana. That That's a really good Eastern Washington team, so I had that upset. Um, but in the end, on, on my Final Four, uh, I went with Kentucky, Wisconsin, Virginia and Duke, and I picked a 58-50 final between Virginia and Wisconsin. Those teams played great defense. Uh, I, I see that being a very low scoring uh, where every basket's uh, hotly contested. But looking forward to tip-off tonight. All right. Well, the challenge has been set, and I think that, uh, uh, of course, I believe that I'm going to win. Uh, I know you're a huge Notre Dame fan, and me being an IU alum, I want I know we both want both of those teams to do well and represent Indiana. Uh, I just don't think they have the talent to be there at the end of the day.